if you're a girl in engineering or just a girl that has to go out into the field for work, keep watching because I'm about to tell you why two-piece sets are far, far superior to those one-piece or onesie coverall things. First of all, it's much easier to get changed. I had an experience one time where I was trying to get changed into my coveralls in a bathroom stall and those sleeves just have a mind of their own. I literally had a sleeve dip into the toilet and luckily the toilet was empty, but it was not pleasant at all to have a soggy toilet sleeve. So you avoid those issues. Secondly, it is so much easier to go to the washroom when you just have to move your pants and not have to take everything off from the top down. And then if you get sweaty, you can just change your shirt or your shirt underneath. You don't have to change the whole thing. And even though these are a men's fit, I do find they fit a lot better in the leg. My coveralls, I even have a pair of women's fit coveralls and the leg starts right down here. So it is so uncomfortable to walk in. I always get holes in the bottom here. They're just way too long. I know you can get them hemmed, but just not a lot, not a vibe. One of the downsides of the shirt is that I cannot get this bottom button done up because it is obviously meant for men that don't have any hips, but that's okay. I just leave the bottom button undone. And I know you don't need to look cute to go in the field, but I just think this is such a better fit. It's such a better vibe than the coveralls. Just fits better, feels better. It's also a lot safer for if you're climbing in vessels or up ladders or going upstairs to be able to have better mobility of your legs and not have a restriction here. I am so thankful for the co-op student that told me to get this two-piece set. It was five years ago she told me and I've never looked back. It is the best and I will tell as many women as I can to forego the coveralls. If you do have a choice, girls, pick the two-piece set and let me know if you have any other PPE tips in the comments and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.